Boom! All right, you guys ready for my wannabe Mr. Beast intro? I actually spent seven days in solitary confinement. So this all started when I watched that one Mr. Beast video about him spending 50 hours in solitary confinement. I'm gonna spend the next 50 hours alone in solitary confinement. And I thought... <laughs> Hours. Well, yeah, I could go a whole week. So, yeah, I was basically just trying to get views. Pretty self-explanatory. So then I just went and made a pretty nice cardboard wall and locked myself in it for seven days. I'm gonna be trapped in this room for the next week. Let the challenge begin. Now hold up a second, let me just give you a quick room tour so you know exactly what's going on. This is my little bed. These are for all my entertainment purposes. Yes, in hindsight, I realized board games and books are cheating. I am genuinely sorry. Although I never actually did use them much. Books, puzzle, board game. This right here, it's my toilet. Inside is actually just a bunch of dirt. I'm hoping it absorbs the smell. I'm gonna use this rusty washer faucet for my water. It shoots straight out. Here's my confinement wall. That bad boy right there is my only light source. So when that goes out, lights go out. The first thing I did was take a nap. Luckily I didn't overdose anything this time and I woke up. But the water actually had some rust in it so I had to filter it through my water bottle. Hey, it's kind of bringing back some memories about something. Wait, no, don't think about it. You see that blanket right there? Yeah, I might have accidentally stolen my brother's blanket. Yes. yes. It, no, stop, it's solitary confinement. Yay. <laughs> I need to use the bathroom. I need to use the bathroom. 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 Mm. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Ah, pee pee in the bucket. I, I, yeah, pee pee in the bucket. Yeah, ah, ah, pee pee in the bucket. Uh, ah, pee pee in the bucket. I grab my pants, pull it down, grab my little. Hi, I think that worked pretty well. I just got myself some moist dirt now. What to read? Ah, let's go with the acting bible. Reading this book for hours. Yeah, I'm starting to get a little bored. This is a little bit of a problem. So I thought doing a space puzzle would be a good idea. Gosh, puzzle vacation. I'm bored, but I'm not this level of bored. I'm trying to get a little hungry, hungry, but nothing crazy. Yeah, let me just remind you guys, I didn't bring any food. I tried meditating, but all I could think about were my juicy lips. <laughs> hey, oops, you guys caught me. I actually did bring some salt to eat. I don't know if I'm supposed to be eating straight salt like that. Aw oh man, I just used the bathroom and I pee pee in the bucket. And I have a feeling the smell is gonna get really bad. I grab my pants, pull it down, grab my little- I was actually just doing that for a couple minutes. It's getting pretty dark as you can see. I'll see you guys in the morning. I'm already practicing my hands this morning because I got nothing else to do. <sighs> I'm getting so bored. It's only like, I don't even know, not that much far in. This is just not working. How can I even play chess with myself? I know my every move. How can I even play chess by myself? I know my every move. What is wrong? Did I actually think that was funny? What is wrong with this guy? Finish the book. I need to use the bathroom really bad though. It's not bad. It just smells like pee pee in the bucket. Yes, this is me eating crack. I'm just kidding. It's magnesium powder to keep my vitamins up. Yeah, it's officially been 24 hours without food, and I already want to eat some toothpaste. That's for. Mm. So sweet. Okay, the kids stop thinking about food. And then they got me a thank you. You guys don't know what's in there, do you? You guys are probably wondering. Yes, I am that guy that midway through a challenge, I revealed that I actually had a secret closet. And conveniently, it's stuffed with food. I also somehow completely forgot about its existence. I can't resist. Well, don't call it clickbait because the title never says anything about me not eating food. <laughs> there you go. Okay, so if I cut myself and go to the hospital called... Call the hospital. <laughs> For now, I'm just gonna enjoy this. Yep, I'm still just eating this. <laughs> you expect me to be doing something else? Oh no. I'm definitely feeling the bowel movements now. Doesn't that look good? <laughs> it's at this moment I realized that what made Mr. Beast's video entertaining was his friends trying to get him out instead of just doing literally nothing. Guys, oh my freaking nature! It's at this moment I realized I had a serious ant problem. <laughs> I have a serious problem. <laughs> Take that clip out of context, am I right? Don't worry, I cleaned it up nicely though. Freak my gosh! Whoa! Said you're the one who's if I was still hungry, I would just eat all those. 
Hopefully those guys go away, otherwise I'm gonna have to sleep up here tonight. Which isn't that comfortable. This is what my place looks like from a higher view. It's moments like this that the camera can't really capture. It's the lighting of a crimson dawn prison cell. I'm trying to sound poetic, I don't really know how. The rain glistening through my window. But for realsies, it was like I was starting to feel lonely, but I wasn't. I just can't really explain these things. At this point, I don't really need to take you through the day to day because it was basically the same thing every day. There was not really a whole lot of difference. I was just stuck in that six by six room. And you could forget the board games. They provided no entertainment for me. But I will admit the books were kind of good. Those ribs do be thick. So all the ant, they're gone. All the old food scrappings are safely in my toilet. Urinated on. Let's go get breakfast. How am I gonna actually eat this powder? Because I don't have anything to cook it with. Well, it's gonna eat the powder. Oh. So my day just continued from there, and honestly, it's pretty boring, so I'm just gonna tell you what I did. I read a book, you know, bounced some balls. My favorite part was bouncing the balls. I also put water in those eggs. Still tasted disgusting, and I threw it out. All in all, it was a pretty eventful day. At this point, day five went like all the other days. Nothing much to it, except there was one big plot twist. I ended up taking a fat dookie, but we do not talk about that. Like, we do not talk about that. Honestly, I don't mind talking about it, but at that point, this video wouldn't be kid-friendly. <laughs> oh, I also decided to not eat anything anymore because I didn't want to experience that issue again. Guess what I found on day six? Yeah, that's right, a scorpion. And let me just cut right to the chase. I end up eating it just because I needed more content for the video. Like <laughs> it pinks me, that's why I screamed. Uh, uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Yeah, so basically I kept procrastinating for like five minutes until I finally decided to gay be up and just eat it. Wow. Oh yeah, I forgot. Gag warning. Uh, oh. uh, should I swallow it? Might have ever size. Oh. Oh my god, I swallowed it. Oh, I swallowed it. I never want to ever think about that ever again. Actually, I wish I just never saw it. Actually, seeing it is worse than actually eating it. I mean, I was literally gagging while editing it, but when I actually ate it, I didn't gag. Oh yeah, also it's the last day. Yes, I did indeed last seven days. Honestly, I don't like this video that much. I feel like it's kind of boring and pointless, but I put a lot of work into it, so could you please subscribe to me? I beg of you.